Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Now today we're going to be doing a tutorial and showcase of this brand new torpedo design that, that I've created. I'm going to spawn it in water and demonstrate how it works. First, the propeller needs to be spinning slightly, and you can just like that let it go. And as long as it's at a low enough speed, it'll stay directly on course. All, of course, all torpedoes veer off slightly, no matter what. And height hasn't been fully tested. Try and have it as low to the water as possible, but if it's not that low to the water, that's also okay. Your water line on your ship should be low enough. Because this is a ship-mounted torpedo, not a plane-mounted torpedo. I would never recommend putting this onto a plane, as it would probably be unstable doing that. But now, for the tutorial of it... It's a very basic design. This torpedo is very good to uh, side scrape an enemy. First thing, you place the um, TNT blocks in a pattern like that. Add two cylinders in the middle of the two TNT blocks. And we'll add a ballast block. This ballast block needs to have low density to keep the rear of the torpedo from sinking into the water, creating a lot of drag and therefore higher chance of just falling over like if if you're on a motorcycle never mind I'm not even gonna make that reference so we're gonna have reverse thrust on our propeller engine and boom just like that it is done make sure that you have all of these settings masked including impact speed well impact speed doesn't matter you can have it zero five three hundred it does not matter um arm on key needs to be on and these this design is very effective towards destroying stuff as i said and side scraping so trying to manage to get this to hit the side of an enemy ship instead of direct on but if it's direct on it's still going to cause a very good amount of damage six blocks in each direction i believe and as well as scattering a lot of stuff around you can flood their ship, you can pretty much ruin them in combat. This is very good. Mainly though, I would use it for putting it onto ships that just currently aren't of great use in PvP servers, but might be in Plane Crazy 2 and or if shredder bugs are not a problem. Like as in, in a private server, when you're doing a battle with your friends, they'll be a great weapon, and they'll be realistic as well. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you soon, probably tomorrow.